I'm going to show you how to install the IconX wallet for Icon. So this wallet is slightly different to some of the other wallets out there. It, it is a wallet that is integrated into your browser via an extension. So head on down to the um, Chrome Web Store, uh, which you can access via the Brave browser or Google Chrome. And let's take a look here. So it's Iconex. Here we go. This is the extension. I'll just click on it. Now, I will add a link for this in, in at the bottom. Just make sure you're using the link that's been supplied. Sometimes, you know, there are fraudulent links added in the store and things like that. You don't want to get hit by that. So just double check and make sure it's the right one. Uh, I know this is the right one. I'll add it to the bra Brave. Give it a moment. Here we go. Has been added to Brave. Use this extension. Excellent. Uh, so what I've done now, it's it's created this logo. It's still not showing here. So what I want to do is I'm going to quickly go and just pin it, so I can have my little logo here, which is the icon symbol. Excellent. That's done. Now. That's it. It's that simple to install the wallet. Once the wallet's installed, let's set up a new wallet. Why um, am I doing this? So one of the reasons uh, it's excellent to set up uh, the IconX wallet is our Icon has the ability that the coins you hold, you can stake them, which is lock them up for, for a period of time, and uh, you get... Uh, a residual income from it. So currently you're talking around 13.5% a year uh, based on the amount you stake of your coin. So, and this wallet enables you to do all of that. And then as well, interact with Web3 uh, websites and platforms that are being built out on the Icon ecosystem. So, but uh, for starters, it is about creating your wallet and, and then once that's all set up, I will I will show you how to uh, stake to to pick and stake your coins so that you earn those returns and th those returns are paid out every day based on how much you have staked, which is fantastic. So here we are. I've clicked on it. It's loaded up a new page, which is perfect. I want to again. There's various options. If you have an existing wallet, you can load your wallet. But in in this tutorial, I want to take you through creating a new wallet. So we'll create, you can see over here, it gives you an option for uh, creating for Icon or Ethereum. These are two separate networks. And uh, in this one, we want to use the Icon wallet for the Icon network. So I'm going to set it up for Icon. So next page is uh, create wallet and enter the name and password. So uh, for this example, setups. Oh, I'll just do that again. Okay, so you've added your password, and the next step is to create the wallet. Pay special attention to your key store files. So I am going to download the key store file. And we'll just put it in my documents for now. OK, 
confirm. Now, what this is, so generally, you know, you have your seed phrase with, with Icon. What it does when you set up the new wallet is it gives you this file. The, similarly to what I explained in some of my past videos, what you want to do is, you know, have your backup system. For me, I have USBs and, and I have for the different wallets that I have created, I've got folders and I then keep whether it be seed phrases or these key store files or um, uh, private keys, which I'll talk about private keys in another video. But for this here we have, I've gotten the backup. This, if my computer dies or anything happens and I sit on a new computer, if I have that file, next time rather than creating a new wallet, I can just restore, grab that file and restore my wallet and all my funds will appear in my new wallet. So this is why this is crucial and ensuring that you keep it safely and, and it's not stored online or any same rules apply just like with the way we set up the Exodus wallet. So I've downloaded this. I'm gonna go here. Uh, now this is this is a private key so in this is also something you want to save. So here we go. Again I'm not gonna use this uh, wallet but I wanted to just quickly save this. Great, so I've saved that again. Keep it safe. These are, these are the things that will restore all your funds, so it's extremely important. There we go, I've got my process, I'll hit complete, and here we are. Here's your Icon Wallet. It is installed in your browser. If you ever want to access it, for example, you've got a new page open, you can quickly click on it. It gives you, you can see the wallet now appears there. If I click on my access, it will load it up in the big page, but you don't need to. If you want to quickly interact with it, you can you can do it via this window as well. Uh, so coming back to, let me close these, coming back over here. So a quick navigation. I will talk through what all these buttons are, um, fields are, but for now, this is your wallet. As you can see, I have no funds in here. The one coin I have is Icon over here. If I wanted to, I can add more wallets. I'm not going to do that. You can connect to your ledger if you wanted to keep offline storage. And over here, similarly to Ethereum, Icon has its own standard of tokens. And if, if there were additional tokens that you wanted to appear in the wallet, this these three dots here give you a a few options to pick from and, and you could add tokens and here we go so the, these are currently all the various tokens on the icon network for now you don't need to worry about this it's just more uh, all the functionality that's on offer for this wallet I wanted to give a quick rundown so here we are extremely simple make sure you back up your key store and private keys keep it somewhere safe offline not on any online storages i know i've called it out three times but that's just how important it is and what i'll do is i'll wrap this up in the next video i will come back with uh, a balance of icon that i have and i will run through how you uh, vote where you can pick teams you want to vote for and you um, stake your icx and every day then you'll start to get rewards and, I, and i'll talk through why why you stake and why you have to pick the teams what value it adds to the ecosystem but at the end of the day you know for 13 percent uh, per year uh, rewards it's it's very worth it to to just understand the reason and the way it, it works excellent thanks everyone for watching